Okay, we're at the stock speed right now. Even though it is a little less than actual 3.4. That's what bio says. I could increase a little bit, but it is what it is. So let's take a look at the idle temp. We're at 61C. It's not really 61, so we have to subtract 27 from that. And we have 34C. So we're idling at 34C. So let's run this. This is pretty quick. So we have to take note real quick. So 74C, 74.8. 75.3, 75 75.5, 76.3, 76.4, 77. Let's run it again. 76, 77, 77 77.5, 77.8, 78. So 78.8. So 78.8 minus 27 degrees Celsius. So we're at 51.8 C. So that's at stock. So let's take a look at 3.8 gigahertz. Okay. All right, now we're gonna take a look at the CPU temps at 3.8 gigahertz. And we're currently at about 62.9 idle 63.9 so let's just remember we have to take uh, 27 degrees Celsius off of that number so 62.5 subtract 27 equals so we're idling around 35 C approximately a little less a little more depending on what that says All right so now we're gonna run Citibench we're gonna just go so fast so we have to jump on this right away or, or you know at least look at the number <laughs> So let's, let's uh, run this benchmark and see what that goes up to. 88, 89.6, 89, 9, so 90, 91. Run it again so it doesn't get a chance to cool down. Ninety-one point three, ninety-one point five, ninety-two, ninety-three. Let's run it again. Now remember, we're full bore. All 16 cores or 32 threads are being slammed. So 94, 94.3. So let's use that number. 90, whoops. 94.3 minus 27 equals, so 67.3C. You know what, that's still pretty good. Think about it, that's actually, and we're rock solid. And you know what I mean? We're like, we're, it's a perfect overclock. We're working pretty good. So I'm gonna take 67C. That's, I'm, I like that. That's actually really, really good. Now I'm sure you're curious of what that 3397 number is. That's actually at four gigahertz, but it's really not really necessary. I mean, I'm, you really need to crank up that voltage a lot. And it's really, you don't really, don't, you don't really, don't, really do not gain anything from it so I happen to like this at 3.8 as you can see that's why I have CPU Z running right here so you can clearly see what we're running and everything all the temps and everything are rocking and rolling right here so anyway guys if you like this video give me a thumbs up and if you're not a subscriber please subscribe take care creative labs I roar plug it in like like this the inside of this is really impressive 100a in the prius the ac adapter one amp charger and it's big and it's made out of aluminum okay as you can see the backup is complete like so now you can create the rate array i mean for the for the price difference between the two